Hiya folks, here's a little fast one for you baby. We've had a few requests, haven't we? Oh yes. And this is to do a jacket potato in the air fryer. Well we've never done them before. We know you can do them because Stacy does them all the time. So we've got two average sized potatoes here. Probably enough to fill one, one per person. So we're gonna do two of them. And- uh, We're all... having one each. Yeah, we're gonna have one each, how about that? So all we're gonna do is with the first one, we're just gonna cut this, put a cross on it. Not going all the way through. So we've basically just crossed about halfway through the potato, and the second one, Sharon's just gonna prick the surface of the potato. This is the way I do it, and that's why you Yeah, be careful, she's a bit of a, yeah? There. Right, so once we've done that, baby, what are we gonna do? We're gonna cover these in oil? Put a little bit of oil on the And a bit of, bit of savoury salt and pepper on the like side. So let's get that sorted now. Right, so all Sharon's got is a little drop of olive oil. We're just going to put that into a bowl. And all she's going to do is turn them over in the oil. Just to give them a light coating of oil. And then just put some uh, seasoning on the top. We're using some Himalayan sea salt. And also a little bit of black pepper as well. And that's the one. Is that your one or my one? That's my one. So that's my one with the split in. So we'll just take that out and look draw from our ninja. And she's gonna just plonk that in there. And the second one, exactly the same folks. Bit of olive oil, just wrap around it. And the seasoning's still in that bowl, so she might just wanna put a little bit of salt on there, baby. No, it's already in there. Oh, okay. I can feel it on my fingers. Right, so that one was just pricked. And all we're gonna do, literally, is just put it in our tray. Turn the old ninja on. 20 minutes and we'll, then we'll turn. Yeah, we'll do it for 20 minutes to just see what happens. And then just press go. So in one of these folks, we're gonna have some uh, just tin chili con carne. You can make your own. This is purely from convenience and we had it in the cupboard. And in the second one, we're gonna have some grated cheese with onion on the top as well. So as you saw probably in the last video, we had the Kasori Dual Blaze air fryer, which was a big single tray jobby. And uh, we've give, actually given that to our daughter and she's over the moon with it. We've just come back from Scotland. We've been up there for five or six days and uh, she was cooking with it all the time and she absolutely loves it. That's got an extra element on the bottom so you don't really have to turn stuff over to. Or shake. Or shake stuff, yeah. Anyway, so we've just had a look online for some ways of doing j jacket potatoes. Some people put pre-put them in the microwave first. Yeah, about 10 minutes then put them in the air fryer. Yeah, but we're not even gonna bother with that because at the end of the day, by having this air fryer, it's actually saved us money on our energy bills consistently for the last three months. And our gas bill has gone down as well. Now we all know what's going on at the moment with the energy prices here in the UK. So any way of making a saving is a bonus. So this thing has definitely proved it's worth for saving money using the air fryer over the big conventional oven and the gas hobs as well. For the gas hobs, as you well know, that's what our chili's gonna be going in. We've been cooking on these little things. These little things are just 15 pound camping stoves. And all they got is these little ga gas bottles in them. You can pick these gas bottles up for a pound and they last quite a while actually. As I say, we bought a job lot of them. And all we do now, we just cook on this surface here. We don't turn that on. Them big jets on that are far larger than the jets on this I little thing here. I don't even use my electric kettle anymore. Mate. Yeah, we, got, we've got, got a whistling kettle. We've gone back to an old whistling kettle, folks. So this is the way we're combating the energy price rises, which again are going to go up again. So we've been told. And the only way to do it is either to pay their money or use, you your, make, noddle. use your noddle, make some active changes in your life to reduce your usage. And that's what we've done. Keep anyway, your money for yourself. We'll put that kettle over there, baby. Yeah. I'll get a little saucepan out. We'll do that and a spoon. We'll get the chili on. Yeah, so these are our little cookers, folks. You just push down the button, turn them on, and they strike up in no time. So we're just going to empty a tin of chili into there. Stag, is it not stag, is it? No. This is just a little Newgate. Little Let's little turn that around there so we can. So it smells all right, but it, it never looks good when nice. it comes out of the tin. Oh, I don't know, I don't know, Mike. Oh, no, I'll just say that one actually looks better yeah, than normal. This one it? actually looks nice. Uh, which makes a change, they normally don't look like they look on the tin. Smell that. It smells like chili, it does you actually know. Smell some like things chili. You, you can buy and you think, nah. Yeah, that one actually looks all right. So I mean, there it is, folks. You, you like the macaroni cheese, and to me, it's like baby food. Yeah, but if you've seen. Uh... No, oh, Pete will be moaning. What? 
Metal on metal? Metal on metal, yeah, people moan about it. Oh, that's a bit high. Yeah, I've turned it up a bit too high. Look how quickly these start cooking, folks, these little stoves, look. So we'll just put that literally on a little flip and we'll let that cook away. And as I say, for the other one, we've just chopped up some onion quite finely and we've grated up some uh, strong cheddar cheese there. And uh, that will be our little meal for today. Right folks, we've actually put them on for 40 minutes, after 20 minutes. She had a look, they're probably half cooked. I've turned them. You did turn them over. Turn them. So she's turned them over and now we've got about a minute to go and she's just brought the chilli back up to the boil again. And I don't know what it is baby, but every time we start cooking food, someone turns up over there, look, don't you? You keep turning up. Unbelievable. So there you go folks, again, that only takes literally minutes for that to heat up. Come over here folks, look. As I say, this is 40 minutes. Here we go, let's have a little look. Oh, look at them babies. And can you see the one that I've split there folks? That's the difference. Sharon's prodded that one, as you well know. Right baby, you're gonna get them out. Pass me the tongues, I will. There you go, baby. I'm for daddy. Oh, that's mine. I'm for mama. Right, so let's put that away first. Switch it off. Now, can we give it a little tap there? Then we can test if the skin's. Uh... I think you mean how crispy is the skin? Yeah. Can you hear that, folks? Right, okay. Now, okay, baby, cut yours open. We'll do your one first. Can you see that? Oh, that's very hot, Sharon, isn't it? Oh, yeah, it's definitely got a crispy skin, that one, folks. Now what you can do, if you hold either side now, you squeeze the potato. I know that. I know you do, baby. I'm telling the people. There you go. Look at that, folks. Look. Look. Now get your knob of butter. That's it. We like to, if you, if you disturb it, folks, we mash it up a little bit inside. Oh, look at that. That's it. Match it in there, shall See what happens, folks. Now get some salt and pepper, baby. Go on, off you go. This is your, you do it how you want, Shell. Oh, thanks. Oh, look. She's gone for the white pepper, folks. Oh, look at that. Oh, you're going on with the onion first. That's unusual. Out comes the grated cheese. This is a strong cheddar, folks. This is really strong. And just whack it on there. Oh, I see, you've, you've made like a sandwich of it. Oh, I love what you've done there. I love what you've done with that. Well done, baby. Right, and you're just gonna let that mature, aren't you? You're gonna let that melt into the actual potato, aren't you? Oh yeah, baby. Right, folks, here we go. Now, mine's already split, as you well know, so I'm just gonna do, oh, look. Look at that. And I'm just gonna chop it up with a knife. Look how soft that is, folks, look. 40 minutes, these are average size spuds, I'd say. And they've cooked completely through. And the way we test them, obviously, you can put a probe in there, but all you do when they're cooking, just stick a knife in, and if it goes in nice and easy, you know they're cooked. So out with the old butter, folks. Now, don't try this with margarine, it's gotta be butter, folks. Just whack a nice, nice dollop in. And I like to massage it through it, shall? Spin it round, different angles, look. Just get that butter running through all that potato, look. From every single angle, look. Oh, by the time it's finished. Eh? Hey, it'll be cold by the time. Faffing about? No, Sharon, it's not. Did you say faffing about? Faffing, yeah. No, oh, I thought you said something different. I don't swear. I didn't say you did swear, baby. It just sounded different, baby. Now look at that, look. And then I'm going to go for some lovely salt on there. Oh, lovely. Tease it in there, look, that pepper, look. I like plenty on. Oh, look, folks. Look, now you can make it look nice if you want. It's entirely up to you. I'll just plonk it on, look. Look, oh, look. And I'm gonna go one step further, Sharon. Oh, what a surprise. I'm gonna go mad, look. 
I'm gonna even do that. And a bit of that. I've got what you call everything on there. That's a loaded one now, Sharon. Now we've tasted this chilli, and this chilli is actually one of the better ones, Sharon, isn't it? Mm, very nice. Right, do you want to go first then? You tell me what that's like. You've let that ooze in there now, baby. Lovely. My favourite jacket potato, this is. Oh. Do it again. I want to see you take, I want to see the enjoyment on your face. Go on, cut that skin, Sharon. Well, is the skin crispy, Sharon? Can you mm. taste a bit of skin? Very nice. Nice, can I have a go? Can't leave my permission. Move over baby, this needs a bit of room. I'm gonna go in for everything here folks. I'm going full metal jacket. It's all on there, everything's there, look. Too, didn't you? I'm going in. I'm going in for a bit of, a bit of skin as well. The thing is, a lot of people think you're actually putting this on, but actually, when he enjoys that, mm. um, yeah. every mouthful. Yeah, let it go, baby. I'm letting them know what I'm you trying, really like. Trying to enjoy the moment, yeah. I've got skin wrapped around the fault, folks. Like you have no options. It's got asbestos I ain't well. take your options. Now I'm not the problem. Oh, man, that's oh, me on you. Oh, me out of four with my knees are gone wibbly. <laughs> you know, we will wobble the Oh, I am, Sharon, I am. Oh, fuck. I'll tell you what, that air fry so far has never let us down yet. Stace is over there dribbling. And we've left a little bit I'm in the pan with her. So you can lick the bowl, Artwood. Honestly, folks, it does jacket potatoes fine. And the thing is, 40 minutes. Normally, in our big oven, that's on for between an hour and an hour and a half, Sharon, isn't it? Mm. So if you want a jacket potato, you want to save energy, get yourself an air fryer. It seems to do everything, doesn't it? Mm. Anyway, I hope you've enjoyed this video, folks. Don't forget, if there's something else you want to see us cook in the air fryer, leave a comment below. And also, hit that subscribe button if you do like our videos. Yes. This is all new to us, but we're finding this air fryer is a fantastic piece of kit. That thing is now redundant, Sharon. I wish I was redundant. Why, baby? Okay, sit down. I'll always need you, baby. Thank you very much, folks. Don't forget to join us on Sunday when we got a lovely vlog for you this weekend. We went up to Scotland. We had a bit of fun up there, and it is a premiere at. Oh, do you hear that? Mm. Premiere at three. No, eight o'clock in the evening, as with all our vlogs. And there's a chat box there, and you can talk to us live. We're in that chat box. And there's a good fall in it. Thank you very much, folks. We'll see you in the next video, and until then, bye bye. Bye for now. Oh, Sharon, that's fantastic. Oh.